so it was about two in the morning and I was totally burnt and we're like arguing back and forth trying to sort through this shit and we did and I hung up the phone but I didn't tell her that I was still pissed and I wrote these lyrics in about 15 minutes and then the next day the producer is yelling at me again and he said are you ever going to write this fucking song and I said I did last night and he said I don't believe you so he hit the space bar and I sang the song and he said that's pretty fucking good and then we still didn't care we put it track number 8 on the sounds in black and white we did not play it on our first tour with Silverstein, Emory, and Alexis on fire. But for the first seven days of the tour, we were not playing this song. And then people started asking, why aren't you playing Ohio's for lovers? And our album wasn't out yet, and we were like, how the fuck do you know that song? Oh, it's on LimeWire. So, we have you guys to thank for this song, not us, you didn't believe it. So for real, I hope you guys realize it, you guys have made a career for all these bands that touch the stage. You've made a career for this style of music. Your parents have things like Led Zeppelin, which is pretty sick. But you guys have all these bands and you've kept us close to your hearts for 20 years. We now have Barnett's Do us a favor. Sing this song as loud as you can. Like it was the first time that you heard it. Probably mislabeled or misspelled on LimeWire. Or maybe on your MySpace player in the top eight. Because you had some sick ass groups with some killer taste. You guys have kept this music scene bigger than it ever should have been because we all grew up in basements, we all grew up in trash cans, we all grew up in the flattest fucking piece of land in the United States. Thank you so much. We're Hawthorne Heights. When we're done, I'm going to go back to the merch table. It's kind of small back there, but if you want a hug, a handshake, a high five, a fist bump, an autograph, I will try my best to make it happen for you because you have made us honestly the happiest people and the saddest people at the same time for the past 20 years and we wouldn't want it any other way. We love you so much. Thank you for coming to 20 Years of Tears. We are all for nights. This song is for you. That doesn't mean you can't fucking sing loud though. Don't be lazy. It's Monday. Down or sweeping up, not enough for weeping.